Hello everyone, Proxy War here, and welcome back to the channel. We are continuing with our Walking Dead series. This is part 13, I believe. And um, yeah, we're picking up exactly where we last things. We had made, managed to get down to River Street with Kenny, um, only to find out that all the boats have been taken and this one's been utterly destroyed. So, yeah, now we want to go take a look, see if we can find any other boats that are nearby, hopefully. And there's a lot of. Uh, boards and stuff around here. Um, I've not played this part yet, so everything Looks you've like seen, I'm seeing for the first time as well. For all the good it did. Oh, why is my... The mouse always seems to like go quite far down. An abandoned newsstand. Yes, there's a lot of abandoned stuff, mate. Give me the money. It's an old cash register. Not much use these days. Nah, money's absolutely useless now. Water and whiskey and stuff, however, much better. What the hell are these markings? They're all over the place. Don't know, man. It's probably some from a construction site or something. Oh. Jesus Christ, what the fuck is that? What the fuck? What is this meant to be? Some kind of... Warning? Who would do something like this? Doesn't even have eyeballs in his head. That is mad. Shoot, I'm not gonna shoot them. Using walkers like scarecrows. What sick bastard did this? I don't see why we would waste our um, ammo on that. So we are going to oh, go back down here. See if we can look through the telescope. Oh yeah, look, there's tons and tons of bodies there. Great. Needs a quarter to work. Oh, that's annoying. Bash it. Damn. Built solid. It's not, it's not just hitting stuff. How are we gonna? Oh, the cash register. All right, fine. We'll go and um, take the money. I hate that it makes us backtrack on things often. Hello, beautiful. Empty. No. Oh. Yeah, that would have been too easy. <laughs> yeah, I know. I know. Stop making fun of the players, all right, Telltale? Um, we are going to need to maybe ask Kenny if he's got a quarter. Maybe he's got one. Otherwise, we have to shoot one of those walkers and go through its pockets or something. Um, Someone must have been trying to back their boat into the water. Yeah. Maybe things didn't go as planned. No, they actually fucked it up big time, didn't they? Uh, we'll go down here and see if Kenny's got a quarter. You got a quarter on you? Don't have a lot of use for small change these days. Maybe you can find one on the street somewhere. Oh, alright, fine. But at least they thought of um, coming up with that option. Um, on the streets. On the streets. Never looked at this marking. Oh, we haven't gone down there. Could be military tags, but what do they mean? I have no idea. I'm not in the military now. We'll see if there's anything down here, maybe. No, you can't seem to interact with anything. Okay. Can't go through the rubbish by the looks of things. Um. Oh, whoops! Wrong button. Whoopsie. Better not. Gunfire would just bring more walkers. No, oh, I'm fine. That's what I thought would happen. This barricade does a good job of making me not want to go any further. But does any of you got pockets with things that we can search for? Uh, 
That ain't gonna work. I mean, know that, but did that Don't work? Don't be able to see anything until I find a quarter. Ah, oh, bloody hell, man! Why do you have to make this such a mission? Can't interact with any of those things. Ah, oh, newspaper stand. That's that. I will have money, won't it? Locked. Of course. Smash it open. Yes. Something useful. Jeez, man, don't say shit like that. What's up with the boat? It ain't gonna work. Hull's cracked beneath the waterline, plus someone stripped out the battery. You can't fix it? No. What the... what the hell is that? A fate worse than death. Okay. No sign of any boots down there. Abandoned, like every other place in this city. No, obviously. Yeah. Plenty of docks, no, no boats. No boats. Oh, there's one. No way that one's salvageable. Nothing but water, not a boat to be seen. Yeah, man. Oh, who the frick is that? What the hell? What are they doing? Get down, get down. Shoot him. Kind of looks like a got like a woman's physique. Why the hell are we hiding? Someone came down from that building at the end of the street. Where'd he go? Saw him run into that newsstand. Could be our bell ringer. How about we go find out? Sounds like a plan. Okay, you head up the middle of the street. I'll go around the side, cover your flank. We'll come up on him quiet, take him by surprise. Just want to talk to this guy. Oh, we're gonna talk. Mm. Seems too easy, man, if you ask me. Oh, where they go? What the? What the frick? <laughs> ah. <sighs> oh, oh, it hit me. Oh, it knocked me out. No! Clementine. Clem? Please don't hurt him. Why's Kenny doing fucking nothing, man? Just sitting there. You can't trust him. What a weasel. You're not from Crawford. Who? You're not the guy on the radio. I'm not a guy at all. Full marks for observation. Kenny, don't! Oh, fuck. No, he's with us! Who the hell are you people? 
Everyone just calm down. I'll calm down once she tells me who the fuck she is. Back off, asshole. The name's Molly. Molly? I'm Lee. This is Kenny and Clementine. We're not looking for any trouble. Hi. You guys really aren't from Crawford, are you? What's Crawford, man? I don't even know what that is. <clears throat> Everything beyond that barricade. What the hell happened to you? You sure you want to know? Yeah, bro. Spit it out. When everything started going to shit, some people got together and sealed off that whole neighborhood. Folks willing to do anything to stay alive. Stop the dead getting in. I try to avoid them. Why? Let's just say they have a zero-tolerance policy for anyone who won't, or can't, live by their rules. So how'd you know we weren't them? Because there are no children in Crawford. Not anymore. You know, they ate them, didn't they? What do you mean, no children? Why not? No children, no elderly, no one with an advanced medical condition. Basically, no one who might be a burden on the community. Mm. Crawford's all about the survival of the fittest. That's how they survived. While the rest of the world went to shit around them. Jesus Christ. Well, just the opposite when you think about it. What exactly did Crawford do with all these burdens? What happened to them? Chuck them in the barricade. Well, you barricade. met some of them already. Yeah. That's disgusting. Fuck me. Yeah. Anyone who got sick, anyone too old, anyone they figured wasn't strong enough to survive. To them, those people were just mouths to feed. A drain on their precious resources. How do you know all this? Everyone in Savannah knew. What was going on inside Crawford got passed around like a ghost story. Except this one was true. Do you know who's been ringing those bells all over town? Yeah, that would be me. I knew it! Lee, I knew she was the one who'd been following us! Fucking with us! Get that finger out of my face, Grandpa, before I jam it straight up your ass. Nah. I haven't been following you. I don't even know who the hell you people are. Calm down, Kenny. The voice on the radio was a guy, remember? Yeah, well, whoever you are, ringing those bells this morning nearly got us all killed. Raise the dead all around us. That's the idea, genius. It's how I get around. I ring a bell in one neighborhood to attract the local geeks towards it. Buys me some time to scavenge the areas they cleared out. Geeks? Is that what you call them? Yeah, you know, like at the carnival? They'll eat anything, alive or dead. That's pretty smart, the bells. Doesn't take much to outsmart the dead. Bunch of dumbasses. You just gotta move fast, get in and out before they start to wander back again. Look, I'm gonna ask you people again. You're not from Crawford, so who the hell are you? What are you doing here? Came down here looking for a boat, hoping to get our people out of here and find someplace safe. Yeah, good luck with that. Anyone with a boat took it out of here as soon as people started eating each other. Mm. Any that got left behind, Crawford stripped them for parts. Cars, too. There's gotta be something. If there was, do you think I'd still be here? I've been over every inch of this city. This whole place is picked clean. God damn it! Fuck! Hey, moron. You wanna keep your voice down? Shit. Since you're not getting on any boat, I'd advise you folks to go back to where you came from before. Oh, here we go. Great. Just right. Where's Chuck, man? Isn't that the the way we came? Fuck. Gunshot must have brought him back. Isn't there another way back to the house? Mommy, is there a Oh, she's Oh well, we don't have Hey! You're just gonna leave us here? Sorry, I must have missed that part of our conversation where you became my problem. Don't leave us here! Please! Don't, don't Come be a on, bitch. Make it fast! Save Clementine at least, man. Jesus Christ. Oh, fuck me! 
Come on, come on, hurry! Oh, no, that's not good. No! You climb over the dustbin, yeah? Hurry, hurry. No. Oh, Jesus Christ. It's the crawling zombie. She's come back. Come on, Lee. Get your ass out of there. Oh, freaking hell. Can't get it open. Here, use that to pry it open. Quickly. Cute, 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 cute. They will definitely fall down that manhole. Yep. God damn. Clementine, can you hear me? If you can hear me, just get back to the house, okay? I'll meet you there. Hmm. Shit. We live in the sewer. Can't go that way. No point looking up. Let's just go down. Solid. Well, lucky she gave us her climbing tool. Oh, don't slip in that. Oh, well, could you imagine? But then saying that, there won't be any working um, water. Like, so that will be like just rainwater and stuff like that. Well, there's some dead rats there. Half eaten sewer rats. Mm. Walkers must be down here too. Oh, Jesus Christ. All right, how are we going to deal with passageway? No. Locked, of course it is. Can't be that easy, guys. Come on. Got a pipe here. What does that do? It's a drainage pipe. Hmm. More dead rats. Oh. Oh. The way out. There's no way I can take on all of those things by myself. Who's that? Enter the passageway. Ah. Looks like some kind of drainage pipe. <laughs> I just gotta go for the water. I'm out here, and not in there. Hmm. Seems loose. Don't move. Shit. Ah, uh, pick up. I have to put on the other one. No oh, shit. Nice. Okay, let's go put it. Oh, let's go put on that one, and then flood the tunnels, I guess. Get in there, bro. Quickly, they are coming. Mm. 
Of the exact same animation. Nice. Oh, it's that Chuck. That looks like Chuck. Oh, mate. Oh, my God. oh I Chuck, liked him, man. He must have tried to hide out down here. Poor bastard. We only knew him for like half Poor an episode. Books. He must have saved the last one for himself. You deserve better, old man. Yeah, man. Oh, that's depressing. Oh, let's go beat beat this one's brains in. Oh fuck! Go, god damn it! Go, god damn it! Q, 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 Q. Ooh, just in time. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that, man. Well done. Well played. This thing has been super handy to have. I'm not going to be able to pry these bars with this. Those bars are way too solid. Mm. No way I could pick that up on my own. Well, then you're pretty useless, aren't you? Go up here, see what we can find. Hmm. Locked. Fucking perfect. Shit! It broke off. I already tried that. It ain't gonna budge. Hmm. How are we gonna fix this ladder? So we check those things. See what's on this side. Doesn't seem like there's much around here. It's just a sign. Uh, can we jump up? Damn! I can't reach it. Use that cool technique like that, what she did. Parkour, parkour! No. What the hell? The parkour did not help. Um, let's move that out the way, see what's behind there. Ah. I think, you, you should be able to put your foot up here and then, well, depending on the angle, I don't actually think you can sort of sweep up, jump up on there. Ah, oh, poor Chuck, man. Just gonna leave him there in the sewer. That's depressing. What the hell? A fallout shelter. Must have been one of those old nuclear fallout shelters. How about this food, man? But wonder if someone's living down here. Don't know, but we need to take the food. Look at all this. It's enough to keep people alive for months. Months, eh, possibly. Oh, fuck. Huh. Who are you? It's all right. It's okay. I, I don't want any trouble. Neither do we. Which is why you'd do well to turn around and leave right now. Look, I'm sorry I disturbed you folks. I'll just be going. You can't let him leave. He's from Crawford. If he goes back there and they find out we're down here... Are you from Crawford? They don't lie to me. I know. Where else can he be from? Everywhere else around here is dead. I came here with a small group hoping to find a boat. We just want to get out of here. How about you just let me go? Ain't no boats around here. Yeah, Crawford well, we don't know everything. that. We don't know that, all right? Until we yeah, got you. I heard. You can't trust him, Vernon. You can't let him leave. What do you want me to do? Shoot him in the head? Why not? Be more of a mercy than anyone from Crawford ever showed us. Think, Vernon. What do you think they'll do if they find out we're down here right under their feet? Damn it. You're right. I'm sorry, friend. Can't take the risk. I'm not from Crawford, but I saw what they did up there. It made me sick. I'm not like them, and I don't think you are either. I think you're a good man. Keep back, or don't. I swear I'll don't. shoot. 
told you he's lying. He I'm not. is one of them. Kill him before he kills us. Oh. Cool. So, thank you for watching this episode of Walking Dead. <laughs> Who are you? Oh. It's all right. It's okay. I, I don't want any trouble. Neither do we. Which is why you'd do well to turn around and leave right now. Look, I'm sorry I disturbed you folks. I'll just be going. You can't let him leave. He's from Crawford. Shut up, bitch. He goes back there and they find out we're down here. Are you from Crawford? They don't lie to me. I know. Where else can he be from? Everywhere else around here is dead. I came here with a small group hoping to find a boat. We just want to get out of here. How about you just let me go? Ain't no boats around here. Crawford took everything. Yeah, I heard. You can't trust him, Vernon. You can't let him leave. What do you want me to do? Shoot him in the head? Why not? Be more of a mercy than anyone from Crawford ever Shut showed up. us. Shut up. Think, Vernon. What do you think they'll do if they find out we're down here, right under their feet? Damn it. You're right. I'm sorry, friend. Can't take the risk. I'm not from Crawford, but I saw what they did up there. It made me sick. I'm not like them, and I don't think you are either. I think you're a good man. Oh, okay. Keep I don't know back. What, I don't know what they want I me to swear do. I'll shoot. What do they want me to do? It's all right. It's oh. okay. Vernon, what the hell are you doing? Vernon. Relax. I'm not here to hurt you. So you're gonna faint? You're really not from Crawford. No, no. bro. I'm really not. Well, uh, we are, or were. We got out of there when they started sealing up the place, you know, started weeding out the sick and the old so their perfect survivor society wouldn't be threatened. No room for weakness or vulnerability in their little master race. You don't look that old, so you're sick? We're sick. We're all members of a cancer survivors group that used to meet here at the hospital. Hmm. We're in remission. But that wasn't good enough for Crawford. They'd already rounded up five of us before the rest of us managed to hole up and hide from them down here. This old basement's been abandoned for years. What is this? A morgue? Yeah. Irony's always high on my list when I'm looking for a place to survive. How did you find your way down here? I told you. My group and I were up by the river looking for a boat. Now I just want to get out of here and find them again. Well, that sewer system you came through runs all over the city. Mm. It'll take you wherever you want to go. Thanks. I think I can figure out my own way back. Vern, you're not just going to let him go back out there alone, are you? Those sewers are like a maze. He's got no chance of finding his way back without a guide. You're not going to be able to get out of here on your own. But we all got our own problems. Two yeah, our I, I don't want to ask. You know what I mean? Constant care. And I'm the only doctor here. Besides, why should we help you? Look, I'm sorry if I scared you. I just want to get back to my people. Back to Clementine. She's your daughter? No. She lost her real parents. I'm doing what I can. You're not seriously considering going with him. You just gotta be honest, right, man. Bree. I had a daughter, too. Lost her in the first days. I'll be damned if I'll just sit back and let that happen to someone else. We need you here. Don't worry. I'll be back before you know it. Let's go. That was really nice of him. You could have maybe drew him a map. I don't like that bitch though. She just like had a shoe in the head. Chop Clementine, down. Clem. Molly. So oh hey, you made it back. Who's this? He didn't tell you about me. Understandable, I guess. I'm the one who put that beating on him when he tried to jump me back at the river. Who's the fossil? 
Where's Clementine? She's around here somewhere. Relax. I got her and Kenny both back safely. You're welcome, by the way. I think you have something that belongs to me. Lee, thank God you're back. Krista, what's wrong? It's Omid. He's gotten worse. Good thing Much we found worse. a doctor. That's convenient. We have a man wounded. Who's this? This is Vernon. He's a doctor. Oh, thank God. Could you take a look at him? You have to help us. Please. Come I'll on. see what I can do. Yes, Vernon. Take me to him. Yeah. It's gonna be like, nah, we need antibiotics, etc., etc., and there's nothing I can do. Omid, honey, you're gonna be all right. Lee brought a doctor. All right, let's take a look at him. I work better without an audience. I'm sure you have more things of your own to attend to. Clementine. Yeah, let's just make sure she's right. Clementine? Man. Where is she, man? Study. Clementine, you in here? Where is she? Why would she be hiding? Clementine? Hmm. Nice study. These people were bowling. Clem's drawings. Oh, mate. Where is she? They're getting dark, man. See that? Clem, you in here? It's a strange old name, Clementine. I think it's it's rather sweet though. Like it suits her nicely, you know, and her character. Oh wait, there's something on the couch. Uh, news. I'll have time to rest later. No, right. Well, there's a bathroom door. It's a bedroom. Clementine, you here? No, hopefully she's not up there. Guarantee she's gonna be Clem? like in the last place I look, and it's gonna be upstairs. Uh, sink. Hello? No. Oh. What are you doing? Ah, uh, you know, just poking around. Yes. You won't find anything. We already searched the place. You'd be surprised what people miss. Trust me, I've been doing this for a while. Where's Clementine? Don't ask me, I'm not her keeper. <laughs> I'm not her keeper. Do I look like I'm in the mood to be jerked around? Where did she go? Last I saw, she was downstairs with your redneck friend and that college kid who hangs around with him. Why don't you go bug them? I don't care about that. I just want to find Clementine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, it's all good. I'm on my way. She, she said that she was downstairs. But, seeing as I'm already upstairs, just in case, I'm going to go through. Clementine, you up there? No, nah, okay. Shit. Where Wait. could she be? Wait for it. Okay. Through the hallway window. Don't see her out there. Where's this bitch? Come on. Clem? Clementine? Where's the stairs, man? Can we not go through that? No. Was he doing the moonwalk? Ah, there we go. Found the stairs now. And take a right. Thank you. Let's run down, please. Clementine! Come out! Please! Kenny? Oh, hey, you made it back. Good job. This guy, Good job. Man. 
What the hell do you think you're doing? What does it look like? Where'd you get the bottle? It's on the, the Found table. It. You wanna throw down again like back on the train? Cause I fight better when I'm shit faced. Kenny, come on, give me that. No, it's gonna get Kenny. Better. Give me the damn bottle. Get the fuck away from me! Getting Shh. wasted's not gonna help anyone. Yeah? Well what is? We are fucked! Molly said there's not a single boat left in Savannah. No way out. We got walkers all around us, that crazy fuck on the radio messing with us. Hell, if now ain't the time for a drink? Fair. I'll probably be doing the same thing, but it's not the smart move, is it? Ben, have you seen Have her? either of you seen Clementine? Damned if I know. Gotta be around here somewhere. Ben, I gave you one job when I left here. Take care of Clementine. Then she shows up out on River Street looking for me. What the hell happened? Hey, don't put all that on me. Omid took a turn for the worse, and Krista asked me to help. I'm sorry, I'm doing the best I can here. She was frantic, and things got kind of crazy. I told Clementine to stay put. Where is she? What else could I do? Don't be sorry. Just tell me where the hell she is now. I think she went out to play in the backyard. On her own? With no one watching her? Man, will you get off my back? She's fine out there. No, she's she not. Be or it's your ass. Dude, this guy, man. One job. One job to look after Clementine. Clementine? Clementine! Can I use the radio? Oh no, she doesn't have the other one. Doors covered in vines. Don't think anyone came in through there. Mm hmm. I wish she'd been kidnapped, bro. You in there? No, I'm just being thorough. Well, she's not in there. Where the frick is she, man? Shrub. She's not in the back, man. She's gone. What the frick is going on, bro? Oh. Oh, what the frick? Oh, fucking hell. Wee! Hey, girl. Hey, girl. Come look. Look what I found. It's gonna be food. Oh, it's a boat. <laughs> of course it is. <laughs> Man, that's convenient. Holy shit. Swear. Oh well. I think that that's a pass, mate. Hope rekindle, no? But now we have to get the other cancer survivors out to us, I guess. Because he's taking a look at our chap. Meat's doing okay? As well as can be expected under the circumstances. I did what I could for him. Cleaned out the wound, 
but he's got a real infection, running a fever. Without antibiotics, I... Will you quit pacing? You're making everyone nervous. Why are you even still here? Hey, if your friend really can get that boat working, you're taking me with you as payment for saving your asses. That's I figure that's fair enough, don't you? That's fair. That is fair. Well? <sighs> you want the good news or the bad news? Uh, let's go with bad news. Let's get the bad news out of the way first. Bad news is, she's not taking us anywhere the shape she's in right now. Gas tank's empty and the battery's dead. So what's the good news? That's it. That's all she needs. Some hmm. gas and a battery. Other than that, she's good to go. Well, how are we supposed to get that stuff? Search the streets. What about Crawford? We should go back out on the street, see what we could find. That's not gonna work. Crawford took everything and brought it inside their walls. They siphoned every gas tank, stripped every battery. There's nothing left out there. You saw that for yourselves. She's right. Well, what about this Crawford place? Sounds like they'd have everything we need. Maybe we should try there. Now hold on a minute. Surely we have to try. If there are people left in this city who are still alive, who still have supplies, but she what doesn't know. can it do to ask? Trust me, you don't know these people. I do. You showing up with a wounded man, might as well put a noose around his neck. They don't exactly welcome children with open arms either. What the hell kind of a place are we talking about here? The worst kind? But I don't see what other choice we have. And just how exactly do you figure we do this? Because from what I've heard, that place ain't exactly friendly to outsiders. That's putting it mildly. We negotiate with them like civilized people. We must have something they'd be interested in taking in trade. Negotiate? With Crawford? Once again, I have to remind you. You have no idea what these people are like. They'll take what they want and then decide whether or not to let any of you live. So what? No one has any ideas? There might actually be a way. I know the sewer system that runs beneath Crawford like the back of my hand. Y'all wouldn't happen to have a map by any chance. Yeah, actually. I think I could lead us through so we could pass under the perimeter and right into the center where they keep their supplies. Hmm. We come up right underneath them, take them by surprise, grab what we need, and get out before they even knew what hit them. Okay, that's not bad. That's better. I've thought about it before, just never had the people to do it. But I think if we all work together, we could pull it off. And what do you want in return for all this help you're giving us? Crawford doesn't just have what you need for your boat. They're also well stocked with medical supplies. Medicine that my people could use, just as yours could. We can do this. We have to. So, it's decided then? We're going to Crawford? We can do this. I know it. Hell yeah, we can. Yeah. Are we seriously talking about this? Yes. I mean, what about the risk? I don't know about you, kid, but I'd rather take a chance on doing something than just sitting around here waiting to die. That boat out there is an answered prayer. Just gotta push a little bit farther. Are you in? Or out. Who cares if Ben dies? We should go tonight. I don't. Under cover of dark. I'll go let my people know. Give you all a chance to prepare. I'll be back before midnight. Be careful. That's how I'm still alive. Not oh, damn, bro. I told you to stay in your room. How long have you been there? Is it going to be dangerous? It's always gonna be dangerous. Always dangerous, man. Crawford. I can't lie to you, Clem. Yeah, it's gonna be dangerous. But it's the only way to get the things we need to make Omi better and get the boat working. That's why we have to do this. Do you understand? I don't want anyone else to die. No one else is going to die. I promise. You can't promise that. Hey man, we got to try. Well, I guess I can't. Sorry. I guess I should go get ready. Uh, say what now? <laughs> you said you'd need all of us to do this. And you said I'm a big help, remember? 
Molly said Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. That means it must be where my mom and dad are, right? Oh, they dead. <sighs> Don't know what to say. Can't I come with you? Oh, what do you do? What do you do? No, I'm sorry. Just trying to keep you alive, bro. Check out what I found in the garage. Hatchet, hacksaw, some other tools. Might come in handy on this little break-in. Nice. Can I talk to you a minute? What's up? I took another look at the boat. She's a 30-footer. So? So, we're gonna have a capacity problem. Assuming everyone makes it back alive, there ain't gonna be room for everyone. What are you trying to say? Just giving you a heads up is all. Thought you ought to know. Who the hell is this? This is Bree. She can help us. Help us how? I was a student at the school where Crawford keeps their supplies. I know the layout. With her help, we're in and out faster. Anyone have a problem with that? I guess not. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get moving. Hmm. Makes sense. Should probably take a... Hold up just a sec. You understand why you have to stay behind, don't you? I guess. Plus, you have a job to do. An important job. I need you to stay here and watch over the house. Watch over Omid. But what should I do if something happens while you're gone? Here. I want you to take this. You remember how to use it, don't you? It's just like I showed you. I remember. So if anyone tries to get inside the house that isn't one of us, or if something does happen to Omid... I know what to do. Let's get you inside. Come on, we're, that's what we've been training for, you know what I mean? On the train, we're shooting up those bottles and things. Damn, bro. The hard choices in this game. Let's get this over with. Yeah, boy, we're gonna fuck some shit up. This should be it. We're right underneath the center of Crawford. The old school should be directly above us. Okay, people, this is it. Remember the plan. We stay quiet, we stay hidden, and we stay together. We find what we need, and we get the hell out before anyone even knows we're there. Got it? All right. I think that's where we wrap things up for now. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to drop a like and a comment down below and subscribe to see even more content just like this on the channel. And I'll check you guys out in the next video.